evaluate 5 by 2 minus 2 by 3 plus 1 by 5. First given is 5 by 2 minus 2 by 3 plus 1 by 5. Okay. Next. In this fraction the denominator is 2. Here the denominator is 3. Here the denominator is 5. As you observe, the denominators are not same. Whenever the denominators are not same, we should take LCM of them. So the LCM of 2, 3 and 5. The first number is 2, 2 is the prime number, so 2 ones 2. The other number 3 not divisible by 2, so you write down as it is. The other number 5 not divisible by 2, so you write down as it is. Here we got 1, so focus on to the other number that is 3. 3 is a prime number, so 3 ones 3. The other number 5 not divisible by 3, so you write down as it is. Now we got 1 here and here, so focus on to the other number that is 5. 5 is a prime number, so 5 ones 5. We got 1 in all the 3 places. So our LCM is the product of these numbers. That is 2 into 3 into 5. So 2 into 3 is 6 into 5 30. Whatever LCM we got here, we should write here in this way. Okay. Next. Here we have 2 in the denominator. Here we have 30. Now, 2 should change to 30. For that to happen, we should multiply by 15. Whatever number you are multiplying in the denominator, in the numerator also we should multiply by the same number. So we get 5 into 15, 75. Negative symbol as it is. Here we have 3. Here we have 30. Now 3 should change to 30. For that to happen, we should multiply by 10. Whatever number you are multiplying in the denominator, in the numerator also we should multiply by the same number. So we get 2 into 10, 20. Plus symbol as it is. Here we have 5. Here 30. Now 5 should change to 30. For that to happen, we should multiply by 6. Whatever number we are multiplying in the denominator, in the numerator also we should multiply by the same number. So we get 1 into 6, 6. Now 75 minus 20 is 55. 55 plus 6 will result in 61 by 30. We cannot simplify this fraction. So this is our answer. Am I clear?